which I did yesterday. Yes. So. Which means it just it just gets hotter the longer it sits in the, the container, and when you get it out on a, a cooler surface, um, it dissipates. Yeah, it dissipates in the bowl. You have a little bit, a lot more working time. Laura says it cooks. <laughs> yeah, it sure does. You cook it now. <laughs> <laughs> Was that that trending song? I was like, let him cook. Oh yeah, let him cook. <laughs> I know what you're talking about. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and we always use a foam roller. Check that out. No fibers. It's the best way to go. And. When you're working the product, if you move the quicker you go, the more like the product's a little bit not easier to work with, or you're not able to kind of move maneuver the product. So if you kind of go a little bit slower, you kind of create this plow effect, and you're able to get that product to go where you need it to go. What's the difference in going slower, going fast in the thickness? Yeah, the difference in going slow and fast is you're able to move that product a little bit more when you're going slower, whereas if you're going fast, see how it like thinned out there? Then you're gonna get an uneven, uneven even surface there. Uh, so let's see. Uh, Drop and Bomb said in terms of getting it out of the bucket, it creates its own exothermic reaction. James says he did light almond with gray and pearl. Light almond with gray and pearl, hey. It's Pretty natural look, like looking. Color yeah. combo, yeah. Like that. Maybe we'll do a demonstration on an actual, like simple white marble, for you guys tomorrow. I know we do lots of fun marble. You guys see that all the time, but maybe something that you would want in more of your luxury home. I know a lot of times we don't do the fun, um, the more simple stuff because. People on TikTok don't want to watch that. Mm -hmm. They want to see, see the crazy, the, reflection of black. <laughs> the crazy colors. Um, so Laura says um, for flash curing, she did it once long, a long time ago. Drop and bomb says nice and steady and slow makes it more enjoyable. Yes. And then also nice and Laura steady said, and it's slow. Definitely a need to do for lessons learned. Yes, that's how we learn. Um, also, on an actual countertop, you would want to make sure you break that surface tension by rolling the edges. So you would want to just go in with some product on your roller and just kind of get the edges. That way when you cascade the product over the edge, it's not clumpy. If that makes sense. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and just cross roll this. We have the whole sample board covered. I just want to make sure that that product is all somewhat even. When we use the torch, it's going to also help us as well. This is self-leveling. This is self-leveling. That's exactly what I was going to say. <laughs> Should we take a look and see what the temperature is now? 76.8. 76? Yep. And we poured it out at 75. 75. So it didn't really change much. Mm -hmm. James said the simple ones don't take very long either. It makes for a short ride. Yeah. Simple ones yeah, don't take very long. So typically, um, what we would want to do is torch at the very end. But since I'm gonna go ahead and spray this with our translucent blue, I kind of wanna pop some of these micro bubbles now. That way, later on when those other, um, if they were to have other big bubbles pop, 
it would create kind of like a cell look. I don't think I have anything in here to kind of show you. But maybe, you know what, maybe it'll happen and I can show you. So typically, once you pour, if you have your temperatures at a good, you poured at a, a good temperature, your atmosphere is at a good temperature, um, you could kind of wait a couple minutes for those bubbles to kind of come up. If you look at the surface right now, you can see all those little bubbles. This torch is epoxied. I can't use it. It's epoxied? <laughs> yeah, look. Oh my gosh. Well, that's That's good. what happens. It's fine. Got my back up. So the reason why I typically like to torch as the last step is because it's going to heat up the product and you're going to have much less working time. So if you're new to working with epoxy or if you have a big area in your kitchen that you need to do, I probably wouldn't torch because then in the very beginning of your design because then you're going to have less working time. So maybe you had 40 minutes before and then you torch, that could probably go down to like 20 or 30 minutes. So just keep that in mind when using the torch because you're heating it up. And I'm not too concerned because we poured this out kind of cold. to go back and go the other direction. Thank you guys for the love and the likes and the shares and the heart knees. You're the best. Thank you for coming to our new channel and thank you for getting us to 1,000 subscribers so quick. It is kind of sad for us here at Countertop Epoxy because we were we were just on TikTok's good side and um, we almost hit 500,000 followers and we were going to have a huge TikTok party. We were going to do an all day live. Before. Yeah, it was going to be an all day live. But, you know, okay. So we have our highlighter. I'm going to kind of just go from one corner to the next. And you can kind of just start off one end and then go all the way off the other. Nice. I like that. Sexy. Mind me spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> That's highlighter. And then I'm going to go in with our glow in the dark or alien glow. Same thing, I'm going to follow that design, that line. We, we're we doing a Northern Lights Laura says, sample. <laughs> Another one. Another. Oh, I'm so excited to see this. I'm always afraid of dropping my phone in the middle of the design. Right? <laughs> I feel like I would just drop it. <laughs> Don't drop it. <laughs> I almost dropped it in the floor when I first started here. The phone? The floor, yeah. Um, and then this is our slime. So slimy. Nickelodeon who? <laughs> you know the, the, the old Nickelodeon building? That one's like totally... Like, it's not like tore down, but they took off all the deco and the decor and stuff when they used to like the filming in Florida. No, I didn't. Back to Hollywood. I went on down a rabbit hole. <laughs> <laughs> Trans Same day like I purple, found out guys. the Teletubbies was flooded. <laughs> Kaya always goes down rabbit holes. It's horrible. Okay. This is our translucent purple. So now I'm just actually doing this as one part of the design and we're going to come back on top. I just wanted to blur. 
Should I? Should I do a brush? Can we do a brush? I Let's got do a brush. Cake, yeah. Why not? Kaya got it for me. We use these little chip brushes. You could use probably. You can use all sorts of things. Yeah. <laughs> you could use it all. Yeah. I like to kind of dampen it with the alcohol. Just to avoid it from sticking so much. And then we're going to kind of just pull this down. Slow the flow. Slow your roll. Save H2O. <laughs> what? Save <No>. water? <laughs> <laughs> that, that was like... Save, save water and shower with your friends. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Alright, let's Cool. Now we're going to go in with our translucent blue. So this is our translucent blue mixed with 99% isopropyl alcohol. Whoa. Quirk, quirk. <laughs> Heavy on it. Okay. And I'm going to kind of just mist it. <laughs> Says our house is a whole lot of inappropriate. Laura, you're on the right channel. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, kind of like stars. So doing like the northern lights. Yeah. And also, it kind of created some selling. But don't worry, because we're coming back through. Some selling or some sailing? Some sailing, selling, <laughs> bag. The one word that Michael cannot bag, say is say. Bag. Hey, I'm South Dakota. <laughs> I get to say that. <laughs> we got some bags. Yeah, you got a bag. You can give me a bag for that. Oh, don't you know? Oh yeah, you betcha. <laughs> <laughs> I, I yeah, we had a that's kind of like the Wisconsin Lord accent had, too. Laura said I had to refrain from mom jokes when Michael. <laughs> When Michael was saying, go slow. Go Laura, sl say them. Yeah. Say them all, please. It's okay, I'm used Which to it. Do you, do, you again. <laughs> <laughs> do you remember who our boss is? Yeah, right? We're not, we ain't afraid. We ain't afraid. I'm used to it. Levi's always like, I'm so sorry, I'm sorry. I'm like, you, you forget that I have like seven brothers. <laughs> right? <laughs> like, okay. It's fine. This is nothing. <laughs> So now we're just kind of bringing those crisp lines back. We probably should not be covering up our glow in the dark, right? Yeah, we want to be able to see that. Sorry. I'm going to spray some alcohol to spread it. Yeah. Let's go over here. And then we'll torch it and light it on fire. <laughs> Larry says, I grew up around all guys. It happens naturally. Yeah. Yep. Laura, you're our, you're our kind of people. Yeah. <laughs> you're going to quit moving so much. Keep laughing and just getting distracted. Yeah, Kaya, do your job. I am bad. I'm, not, I'm good at it. I'm good at my job. Before I dig a hole. <laughs> <laughs> I just get distracted easily. I'm, I'm going to come this way again, okay? It's like vortexy. Alright. Vortex. Um highlighter? Yeah. Yeah. Why not? Yes. Some more highlighter. Bill says, Bill Palomi says, I am sorry they messed with your page. That's okay. Thank you so much. It's a lot of hard work, roughly what, two years? 
It's fine. We're fine. Laura says, okay, it's the worst one ever. Was my mom getting a mustache and my friends tried to do your mama jokes on me. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, and James says, is Joe working today? I need to call her. Um, no, unfortunately, Joe's been having her, she has little twins. Um, one of them has been fighting a fever this whole week. So she was out half of the day yesterday. And um, she's out all day today, unfortunately. Fortunately, but unfortunately. Because I know what that's like. <laughs> Being a single father. Oh, yeah. Michael <laughs> was taking care of his nephew. My niece. I've been taking care of my niece. So, yeah, she's, my bad. I don't know why I said that. She's three. It's been... Single it's been, dadding for yeah. a week now. It's fine. Dropping Bomb says Joe got twins with a bunch of exclamation points <laughs> and question marks. Yeah, Joe has twins. They're adorable. They're six now? Six. Five or six, yeah. yeah. Laura says, oh no. Laura says, three is fun. <sighs> yes, okay. Three is fun. <laughs> However, I don't enjoy the meltdowns. Colin says it looks great. Thank you, Colin. James says, oh, I'm sorry. I hope they get better. Yes. We do sounded go. pretty in intense. We need Joe back. Yeah. We were going to have her bless you guys today. Mm-hmm. But. Laura says easy to fix. Color, snacks, funny dances. True. You know? Color dancing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Cool. Hey, All right, so I'm going to go ahead and blur these. Let me, let me get a good before. Blur them all up. Okay. You good? Andrew says, I like what you do. Thanks. Thank you so much, Andrew. Laura says, wait till preteen and teen. OMG. No. Thankfully, I... Well, I do have nephews and nieces who are preteens, so. I don't want you to lose it. It'll kind of come back when I hit it with the torch and the alcohol. We're just layering. Let me try not to get that on the floor. Okay. Andrew says, I'm in Uganda. How do I get to you? Andrew in Uganda. Um, you can email us at info at countertopepoxy.com. We do ship worldwide. Um, and we might be working on something special for our people overseas. So keep an eye out. So we have a couple things in the works. So make sure you're subscribed and have your bell notifications on. Oh, Dropping Bombs has twins. My twins are fairly easy, but dang expensive. Oh, you got twins? How old are they? Kai wants to know how old they are, and are they identical? Joe's are identical. Hoping I had enough product for a final dirty pour on these two. Electric looking. Twin boys 11. We never had. Twin boys? We never had the tested shared the same placenta but different sex. Mm -hmm. Never had them tested, I think, even. Just the same as under different sex. Twins are pretty cool. Does that mean fraternal? I don't know. We have, you know, um, I think.
think it'd be nice to have, you know, a twin. I think if, it, to an extent because they could entertain themselves, but I feel like it would just, it would be a lot because there's constantly something going on. But I meant like as a twin, it would be oh. kind of cool to be a twin. Maybe. I had good friends in high school that were, um, that were twins and no one could tell them apart, but once you like got to know them, you could like tell them apart, you know? Yeah. Um, but they were so polar opposite in their personalities. Like, one was a swimmer like me, and the other person was a softball player. And, like, they had completely different friend groups. One was, like, drama kid, and the other one was, like, super sporty. Dropping Bomb says, we can tell them apart, but the others are constantly asking who's gutter and who's why. It's so kind of the same. <laughs> um, Andrew says, do you train or teach those who are interested in this? Gunner, right, Gunner? Andrew. Oh, Andrew. Sorry. Um, Gunners want to drop a bomb skit. Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Andrew, we do have workshops here in Grand Junction, Colorado, monthly. We are on a workshop tour right now. Um, so we have one in Florida that's happening right now, and then in North Carolina. I don't know if there's anything in this. Let me scraper. grab a little scraper. Um, North Carolina, I think, is it the 23rd, 25th? Something like that. Mm -hmm. We have it all linked in our bio. Um, and then oh, I we will. We will. I think... Um, oh, well, yeah, okay. I forget we're on our Countertop <laughs> Epoxy live channel. Um, if you go to our main channel, Countertop Epoxy, you can find all of our links there, or just go to countertopepoxy.com. I don't know how far out we're scheduled here in Colorado, because our home office is here in Col Grand Junction, Colorado, and we host them. We try to go every month on, on workshops, but recently... There's been a few that we haven't done, just because we've been out of town. I forgot about the dirty poor guys. Oh, John Bomb says, I'll be bringing us all down for a class this next year, hopefully. Sweet. You better. I can't wait to see you. Meet you, yeah. Levi will, will love that. Oh, for sure. Yeah. I'll have him um, start up the smoker and cook us some, some, good, some food. good food. Okay. Yes. Dirty pour. I can't see. There we go. Let's finish off on the side. How long have we been live? Mm, I don't, it doesn't tell me. So I think we've been working with this product for a hot minute. Yeah. I don't know what time we live. It's 2 o'clock right now, though. Yeah, it was like 1.22 when we were mixing, remember? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're right. James says, I'm hoping to come back this summer. Yeah, James, hope hope we get to see you. I don't know everything yet, but I do know that there's a couple awesome things lined up that Levi has as far as like remodeling here. Mm -hmm. Andrew asks, for me who is in Uganda, how do I get the chance to train with you? Um, so I don't know. Should I YouTube. should I spill the thing? Okay. Or, or Currently you can find a lot of our stuff on YouTube. Oh. There might be a potential, um, you know, a couple courses happening online. Don't tell them I said it. Um, but those are still in the early stages, so just keep an eye out. Okay, Kaya, if you want to, actually, yeah, if you want to come this way, maybe. I'm going to kind of tip this. Oop. Let's tip it. Why not? Just kind of. Let it blur. Yeah. Gianna said, oh, let's see. Oops. Okay, hold on. Let's hit it with some 99% isopropyl alcohol. 
kind of. You might as spray me too while you're at yeah. it. <laughs> Let's get that cell look. Cause I, I like that. I know a lot of people don't, but I do. Uh, Laura says, Michael Sheridan, you talk too well. He's doing it on me. Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna finish off today's design once that um, alcohol evaporates. You're gonna see it looks a little dimply. That's just the alcohol sitting on top of the epoxy. It will evaporate. We're gonna do a fine mist of this translucent purple on top to kind of finish it off. I'm going to kind of want it to be heavier on one end. Living Aloha says I didn't get a notification for the live. Sorry about that, Living Aloha, we are, this is our first live, so, on this channel. Um, make sure you have the notifications on, and then you go to the settings on that and say for all. Not just some. Not just some, yeah. Because there's settings you do have to change in there. Oh. So we're glad you could join Whoop. us. Um, Javier is asking, do you have classes in Spanish? Javier, we did do a Spanish class. Um, we more than likely will have future ones. However, we're just wanting to, things are changing a little bit. So once we kind of figure out the course for that, um, I'm sure we'll have eventually another Spanish course. But as of right now, we don't have anything lined up. I'm gonna grab some translucent gold because I kind of want the ends there. A little more gold into a red copper. What do you think? <laughs> Your shoe? Yeah. You know, and we kind of were trying to get to the live really quick today. So we did, I probably I did not need that much product. <laughs> Kind of my bad. Sorry. Um, Job and Bombs to Living Aloha said, so gotta be a better stalker with the winky face and then the sunglasses emoji. <laughs> um, Laura to Job and Bombs said, shh. And then they reverse talked and Job and Bombs to Laura says, we got that down, don't we, Laura? <laughs> um, Living Aloha is asking what the base color is. The base color is just our black liquid pigment. And then I sprayed some translucent blue on top. Okay, that was translucent gold. I'm gonna go in with a little bit of translucent red on the corner here. I kind of wanna ombre it into that corner. What color is this again? This is translucent red. Oh, okay, thanks. Just bring that in, this is slightly nice. Yeah, same over here. Covered in this today. Yeah, I don't. You don't typically do the lives much, Kaya. But when, when I'm do, done I with the lives, there. yeah, <laughs> Levi has me drenched in all <laughs> the colors. That's what happens. It's part of the job. All right. I think I'm gonna kind of end it here. Light it on fire. Light it on fire. Yeah. You, no, you don't have to do that. In honor of Levi. Yeah, I don't have anywhere alcohol. <laughs> Maybe over here. No. Uh, Gianna sent me in hearts. Thank you, Gianna. We will try to work something out for you. Sorry about that. All right, guys. Thank you for joining us on our first live here on this channel, Countertop Epoxy Live. We will be back tomorrow with some 
pretty cool stuff. Um, hopefully, maybe we'll do some uh, simple marble for you. I know we have a couple requests, so we might throw some of those in there. Um, or comment what you would like to see on our last video, and we will do our best to get to it. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Michael with CountertopEpoxy.com, and have a great rest of your day.